Good day royal fans and welcome back to the channel for today's royal headline. Prince Harry forced to reassure Queen over name change snub. Prince Harry ditched his royal surname last week. However, the Queen has been reassured the decision was not a personal dig at the royal family. Details of Harry's name change came to light after the Duke of Sussex registered his new eco-friendly tourism firm Travelist. The registration documents confirmed he had ditched both his HRH title and the royal family name Mountbatten Windsor and was instead listed as Prince Henry Charles Albert David Duke of Sussex. According to a US Weekly resource, the name change was not meant to offend the rest of the royals and was purely personal. The bottom line is, he prefers to keep it casual and be known as Harry, the source said. They added the Duke, who stepped down as a senior royal last month with his wife Meghan Markle, reassured the Queen that his decision to unofficially drop the family name was not a personal dig. The source added the Queen, his grandmother, still means the world to him. Back in February, Prince Harry spoke at a travel summit in Edinburgh and asked delegates to just call him Harry. Before he took to the stage, the Prince told host Aisha Harzirika she should introduce him as just Harry. He's made it clear that we are all just to call him Harry. So ladies and gentlemen, please give a big, warm Scottish welcome to Just Harry. She told the room at the Travellers event. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex stepped down as senior royals on March 31st and have been living in Canada and the US ever since. And while the couple had hoped to make a clean break and become financially independent, royal commentator Angela Mollard says that Harry may already be feeling very isolated and beginning to regret his decision to cut ties with the royals. I really worry about Prince Harry, Angela said on New Ideas Royals podcast. He is someone who is very connected to his family, as it is all he has ever known. He had his life with his mum, Princess Diana, and his dad, Prince Charles, and then he had his life with them separately when they divorced. Then he lost his mum, and then he was with his dad and Prince William and the structure of the royal family and the work he has done within that, particularly the military work, have been a very stabilizing influence in his life. He has no connection with that now. Wow, quite a deep video guys. Take that all in, think about it, leave a comment, like the video, subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching, goodbye for now.